Can you please hit the Can button? I get a zoom on that, if that's well, yeah. possible? What are we looking at? The, the, the loopy. Blue loopy. Ah, uh, got it. Bloopy. Bloopy. Yeah, you can either grab it or you can just hook oh, it on the fingers. Gabby was last on here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's pre-set up for your convenience. Spaghetti. And then I go this way? Sure. E. Go, keep going. Can I get a zoom out? Bye bye. Thank you. Good job. There it goes. <coughs> Maybe I should have put it away better. Okay, ready for the reset? Yeah, let's go for it. Hello, bubble? Good to go? Yep. And I messed this up. Can you press that button again, please? Oh, okay. I did the wrong thing. Okay, and Herc is on the go. I'm gonna turn down light off. All right. All right, Send craft is out. secure. Thank you. Bubble back on the porch. And out of the I should probably get moving, shouldn't I? Here we are. Okay, well, we are all good to go. What are we sciencing today? <laughs> well, it looks like we have probably less than 400 meters to the peak and two hours and 15 minutes left in this dive. So we have a, a pretty leisurely pace to, to explore and look around. I think there's space for <clears throat> three more rocks. There's a slurp jar open. Uh, I guess we can't do anything in the front bio box, and uh, that's what I've heard. Yeah, Pandora's so, box. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So just like take our time leisurely, you know, maybe spend some time up at the peak when we get there. But there's there's no hurry. Take our time. Get plenty of zooms. Cool. Great. Well, just holler if you want to see anything yeah. in particular. You know the drill. And Go ahead. We'll keep going. Okay. How shallow is the top? Way point seven. Um, Stand by one. Standing by one. Um, Wait, point seven is about um, 2160. 2160, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Trying to do your math. Yeah. Yeah, I'm still surprised how many nuggets have been on this seamount. Steve said the the seamount should be dubbed Mount McNugget. <laughs> Min Nugget. Mig Nugget. Yeah. That's what I said. M Mount Min Nugget. Mm-hmm. So what time should we be leaving bottom? Between 10.05 and 10.15, depends how fast we think we can come up. Nice. Yeah, it looks like a bunch of talus here. Broken up pillows. I think 10.10 is what the difference. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Welcome to the 8 to 12 watch once again second time today we love that yeah double slipper shift yeah i mean well this one we're recovering but that's okay 
we've done it. We've made it through it before. <laughs> yes, we can do it again. That's some yes. of the best times. <laughs> we get to chat with each other. Yay. <laughs> so much team building. Yeah. Team bonding. Team hmm. bonding. I want to trade. Trade teams? <laughs> trade team? You wouldn't dare. Good no. <laughs> We've welcomed you with open arms. <laughs> Ignoring that. <laughs> um, Ooh, hello. Ooh. Ooh, look at the Not Atlanta. ignoring this. <laughs> no. No, we're just ignoring Rob. Yeah, that's fine. Beautiful. A bamboo. Oh, like Multicolored. Oh, well, that's a nice rock out. Yes. There's a primnoid next to it. <laughs> Is the yellow part zooanthids? You got it. Noise. That is gorgeous. Even gotta be a squat lobster in there somewhere. Oh, there's gotta yeah. be. There's <laughs> gotta be a squat. I, I think we have eyes on it. It's like prime lobster habitat. Paula is working on that. <laughs> <laughs> She's been quiet, you know, looking for a squat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> is that one? I think there's one. Where are we? Um. It, it, to the left in between the pink coral and the not pink coral right right there is that not Any one circleage yes. point it uh. <laughs> yeah in the middle <laughs> over almost. here oh no sorry yeah. <laughs> over there other left uh go ahead and zoom please those are the uh, anemones uh, oh, oh, yeah, rats. with some yeah, bear coral. Metroid anemones. Oh, wow. I tried my best. But, uh, yeah. yeah. That's a good shot, you know. You never nice. know until you know, you know? You know? I know. know. We know. We know. Now we know. <laughs> How will Oh, I did know? see one down here. Oh, oh yeah, 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 there's yeah. a spot. Lobster. Maybe that's where I was circling the whole that, entire time. That's, that where, is, that's what you're looking that at. That is how many species. What do you think? Now we're not ignoring Rob. Species? Uh, if we zoom first. Go ahead, zoom. Yeah, so oh, I would just oh, that's right. really going to be interesting to sample mm. that. Oh. <laughs> oh. Munidopsis? This is a Munidopsis. Yes. Um, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll leave it. Okay. <laughs> Look at the sunset in wire cam. Beautiful. Uh, wow. We were uh, watching the sunset from... <laughs> The from the t yeah, from the TV. <laughs> <laughs> it's better than real Please. life, that's for sure. <laughs> no. Uh. These days the same, same, same. Oh, oh yeah, they put it on channel three. Yeah, I was also watching it. It's really beautiful. So I think it's time for intros. Uh, I'm Stephanie, natural, cha bleh, natural science and children's <laughs> illustrator, coming to you as the SCF Science Communication Fellow. Oh my gosh, is that the coral in the Sea King? Yep. That's so cool. That means it's still taller wow. yet. Oh, it's really tall. Oh. Oh, let's get a zoom on that. Oh, let's get a zoom on the polyp there. change, please. What's going on there? Why are we are they retracted? Why is this different at the top? Uh, it's it's, so it's coloni colonized by no. Zoanthids. Oh. oh. They're, so ch they're so like chunky so compared different. to the other ones. Can Zoanthids change color? Mm. No? No, I don't know. These are like pink so. and they're usually like yellow. Well, because they do, they should be different species. Oh. It's pretty long. Wow. Wow. That's crazy, huh? How tall is it? Look in the Atlanta camp. I don't know. Quite. <laughs> Quite tall. <laughs> so Taller than her. Her is seven meters from the bottom? Uh, not in actuality. That's not true. Okay. Best thing to do is me to land beside it, see what happens. Back to back. <laughs> see how tall you are. That's beautiful. 
Bamboo. It's definitely taller than Herc. Mm -hmm. Like, no question. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's gigantic. It'd be neat to stand next to one of them. It's kind of thick, too, like thicker than your average. Yeah. So this is probably, this is more obviously farther down than the bottom of it. I would say it's, oh, two and a half meters. Is that even a bamboo? Are there nodes? Yeah. Good point. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's a bamboo. Are there nodes? <laughs> node check. Node check. Check node. Show me the node. I think we're nodeless. Nodeless live. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That was funny. All right. And you forgot on, about please. the first time I said it, so I can say it again. <laughs> <laughs> I did, yes. Can you come up on Delta, please? Roger. Coming up on Delta. I didn't forget about that. <laughs> Quite important. Yeah, it looks like we have some sheet flows now coming up. In Where's place. he going? He's going the wrong way again. Ooh, look at these. Shrimp. Shrimp? Trevor, I can see on the map where our watch started. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? Trevor's signature. <laughs> Maximizing scientific efficiency. Something, That's something. Good. Yes. Those are words. By Sound the track, positive. we know the I will be pilot. <laughs> <laughs> I will say something I've never done is write my name with a, the track. Yeah, I've never done it. Yeah, that would be Can fun. we zoom this? Yes, we can. Put on the brakes. Okay, zoom in, please. There's a squat. Where? It's Under the rock. Oh, All the way in the bottom. Oh, yeah, <laughs> nice. Oh, no, Paula, your squat vision. There's a squat, squat zoom, please. So yeah, this is the one I want. Okay, come wide, please. It's facing the wrong way, rats. This is the squat she wants. This is a species that is in the Okeanos deep sea guy. Oh, that's really small, isn't it? How can you tell? Like, it just looks like a blob of uh, squat. Is it escapey? Uh, it's gonna be escapey. Do you want to try it or do you want me to try it? Yeah. You should probably do it. Okay. Oops, that's the wrong button. I would say oh, no. yes, but I think the ship's moving at the same time. And you I, bet it is. I want to stay on Atalanta for that. All right. Can I get down light, please? Roger. And then you can set up slurpage. Slurp setup. Oh, yeah, that does look similar. Let's go with slurp jar number two, please. All right. Hmm. Wrong button. There we go. Okay, so let's zoom in on this microscopic thingy, please. Shrimp count is 43, oh, no chat. way. Woo. No Either way. way. How much slurping? Uh, 80%. That's not on the right jar. We're putting them in two? Two. Is that the right jar? Yep. Yeah. We're okay. putting it in with the isopod from this morning. Roger. Slurp is at 80. Did we get isopod it? Isopod gets a roommate. A it's roommate. gonna be a roommate. Oh no, it's over here. Oh, there's two. Oh, oh. Whoa. Let's get oh them a double. All. Then they were roommates. Roommates. <laughs> that one did not move from the rock. Oh, oh, oh! Something flew Is in there. Is that lobster or isopod? I don't know. <laughs> that they're isopod's going, going, for, going a for a wild, wild ride. ride. Yeah, it's stick to the rock. Hmm. Well, I don't see him anymore. Uh, come wide, please, video. Oh, oh there's oh, a squat in there. In there. It's, it's in, in there. there. All right, it's you can the secure, <laughs> please. Uh, you can keep it go keep it going for a bit. The section? Just yeah, just in case there's a second one. <laughs> I tried to sample two. The tornado. Ooh. 
Dita was the sample number for this? All One right. six zero. Thank you. Ghost go. Squad's world just Thank got you. rocked. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Are we uh, good to zero the suction? I think so, yeah. Roger. All right, let's see what falls down. Oh, never mind. Oh, do you wanna do you wanna look at it? I oh. prefer the suspense. <laughs> oh, oh. There's the isopod. You come up on Delta, please. Dazed and Aren't confused. Up on Delta? There's a swimming. Oh, there is. Yep. Yeah. <coughs> At least one of them, maybe two. The isopod oh, no. is giant. The no. isopod's on its back. What's the swimmy thing in this jar? Weird. Oh, right. I'm another long one. At what? forty. Roger. So, if you're if you're experiencing hydraulic drop. If, you're ex if you experience any of these symptoms. You Please may be entitled to financial compensation. <laughs> what is hydraulic drop? What is hydraulic drop, Annabelle? It's when, so all these different things are powered by the same hydraulic system. So if there's power being put to the jars, that power might not be going to the thrusters oh. as much. All right, I'm zeroing it. Roger. Limited quantities of juice. And speaking Literal. of, Anna nice speaking of Annabelle, who is Annabelle? Introduce yourselves. Oh. Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> All at once? Yeah. Like, Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Hey. Trevor. Hey. 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 Okay, now that introductions are out of the way. <laughs> I'm actually satisfied with that. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> it's, it's efficiency. We're just going to keep coming up with new ways to introduce ourselves. It's exactly. just getting worse and worse every time. Like Rob, Rob, did you say you saw a fish in the sea? No, I said it was efficient. Oh. It was efficient. No. Sea. Sea. Would you like us to introduce ourselves for real? No. <laughs> We've lost the, the privilege. Same, same, same <laughs> Chat knows who we are by now. <laughs> Anatomy down there. Yeah. Maybe it's a friend. Is this a friend another hydrate? That was fun. Um, <laughs> Chat has a more serious note. How does the slurp work underwater better than out of the water really vacuum pump yeah it sucks water uh, it's a vacuum yeah water vacuum so if there was no water it would have nothing to suck hmm. yeah it's, yeah it's, it's like a land vacuum it's like a but in the water these corals this is do you oh. want uh, a wide view, or you want to oh. zoom in real tight? What would you like? Let's, let's mm, do a zoom. Okay. And Go ahead, Dave. Looking for association. These, these fans are fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Beautiful. Beautiful. They're beautiful. Fantastic. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Oh. We're on a roll tonight. Ooh. Oh, a brittle. Bye, Fred. It's going to take days for you to get back up there. Where'd it go? Gone. I'm gonna reset my auto heading. Neat. There we go. You don't wanna go to 474 <laughs> degrees? I don't know. All right, thanks Dave. I don't know what they're doing on the four to eight, but. Chat said, who are you guys? You got that one chance chat. Rewind <laughs> it and listen. <laughs> <laughs> go Beavs. <laughs> so that's all that was. <laughs> I made Is out this an, I had. Uh, enough divers to get a Minsky? Well, I mean, Steve said probably just pop one more. Okay. I'm not sure if you should wait to the very top, but if you you make the call. Do you feel lucky? Look, it's <laughs> creating like a wall. If we pop five Niskins or six, do you feel lucky, punk? So we have here only have four. Other yeah. other species. Maybe we should wait for the, the, top. the top and the summit. It's up to you. Not many yeah. dirty, hairy fans. We're going to make it, right? Yeah, we'll make it easily. So let's, let's save it. We have four Niskins left. Oh. I mean, if we have four left, 
Okay, so let's do it To here. tell you the truth, I lost count myself. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. Uh, such a great right, quote. Get, I'm uh, with you, Trevor. Craft out. Oh, I'm going to come up on Delta first and get Atalanta situated. Is that it? No, never mind. All right. Yes, that is a rock. Oh, oh thank you. Where? Wait, where? <laughs> Talus, even? Tell us what you we're looking at right now. Yeah. Okay, tell us about it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, uh, ready for the uh, Niskin? Yeah. Niskin I don't know if three. I'm ready for the Niskin. <laughs> yeah, you got to pull a ball this time. Pull a lotto ball. Oh, I do have to pull a lotto ball. I'm not ready for the Niskin. Okay. To turn turn the thing on, that would be helpful. There it is. I figured it out. Nice. <laughs> I know what we're going to do for our next intros. You have to say your intro backwards. Whoa. Don't know if I can do that. You're going to have to write something down and read it backwards. Not like the word backwards. Like letter for letter? No, not letter for letter, oh. word for word. What if I memorized letter for letter? Would you then be mad? <laughs> no, you get extra points. Okay. I, I'm just going to turn around in my seat. Oh, you're just going to what? Turn around in my seat. Oh, <laughs> you know, that's backwards. clever too. <laughs> <laughs> Someone watch Niskins, please? Yep. Okay, which ones? Which ones are the ones you can see? Three, four, five, six are free. Okay. <coughs> so, Paula, what what flavor of corals are these that we're seeing? So that side of the jaws, it'll this, the ball will slip through. Corals? Yeah. Okay. Roger. You gotta use the other side. What type? Yeah. Bamboos. Okay. The branching bamboo. Oh, the branching bamboo. I don't know the clay. Got it. Good, yep. Oh, oh, oh. oh, no. Did I get it? Yeah, yep. you got Did it. it pop? Okay. You gotta pull it about an inch. The rest is bonus. <laughs> that sample feel, 161. I feel like I'm always now. mucking around Thank in you. Magnum's business whenever this happens. Yeah, that's kind of the nature of it. Oh, poor Magnum. <clears throat> Just getting yourself revved up. Well, I'm not. I mean, there is a a broad nose here, but this isn't like a a typical ridge. But it looks like these are just a, nice. a high area of rocks that it likes to be following. But it may be on the nose of this little All right. region. We're secure. And bubbles back on the porch. Coming up on Delta. A question in the chat is the Paragorgia arborea we have been seeing so flat and one dimensional because it aims to capture prey coming from one direction from the current. Like the boy band? <laughs> That's what I was thinking too. <laughs> That's what I thought too. <laughs> yeah, so what, what is the current doing? Is it going from, uh, from aft to, to the forward now? Can uh, you tell? This direction? Yeah. Okay. It's coming straight at me. Gauge check. Okay. So then kind of, yeah, because they're flat in the direction that the current's flowing through them. Yeah, they're even wiggling in the breeze down there. Yeah. I'm surprised how all the colonies are, like... Aligned. Aligned. Yeah. And I was wondering if there is something... <laughs> Well you, well, you can see this little tube here of lava that's coming out. I don't think it's that much of a prominent ridge, but it does look like there is a, a ridge feature here. A little bit of flow focus. Yeah. It's like a barrier. A shrubbery. A shrubbery, a hedge, a, a hedge wall. What are they called? 
Corn maze? Sure. Corn maze. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bleach, no. what's back there? Can we disturb 5 zero meters during 275 degrees, same speed? Roger. Roger, thank you. A little diverse chunk of rock here. These corals are a little bit scragglier looking. Yeah. Look at the flappy white thing over here. Ooh. Where? Spongy. Oh, no, it's not so flappy. Never mind. Oh. It's not actually flapping. Yeah, never mind. We're at a depth of 2,209 meters. Thank you. Sediment ripples. You got a new word of the watch? Yeah, there's two. Ooh. So one is um, like a compliment, and the other one is a biology. Like a compliment? Mm-hmm. Nice job. No. Nope. Mm. Cool rock. No. Nope. <laughs> Complimenting the rock. I love that. <laughs> One is a compliment. I like this because Good as time. we arbitrarily try to guess it, we'll just end up complimenting each other all watch. Aww, exactly. Aw, how sweet. Yeah. Trevor, you're an amazing pilot. Thanks. <laughs> no, that wasn't Let's it. Let's keep going around. <laughs> Stephanie, you're really great at thinking about all these uh, contests and your stickers. Her work is amazing. Thank you. <laughs> Rob, you really know your rocks. <laughs> Look at this big ridulator. Wow. Wow. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that looks like the continuation of that so thing, many too. Of I think so, yeah. Ooh, oh my goodness. What is that? Winch tension. Hey, winch tension. Hey, hey. Um, what about it? Gauge check finish. I it wish we can go in there. It was 9,000. It was 9,000? 9,900 something. It was under 10,000. Oh, neat. Yeah. That's preferred. It Trim. is preferred. I know. It's Trim. it's it's ideal. Good job, buddy. Yeah. Keep keep oh. going. Oh. oh, show us the right way. Right on the porch. <laughs> he wanted him to show Delta, us please? the way, and you just ran him over. Uh, oh, Roger. This is amazing. That one's huge. I don't know, Trevor, do you want to drop in here and grab a rock? Yeah, Ooh. do I? Oh, you got me. Roger. I'm going to go a little more left first, Rob. Sure. And then we'll drop in. And I just want to clear the shrubbery. Uh, do you mind if I turn uh, port starboard lights on? Sure. We're going to be grabbing a rock. We'll need that any moment. Wonderful. Is this a, I need to figure out everything so I grab a rock? Figure it out. Figure it out. Okay. Um, yeah, I think the Delta's good for now. Yeah, stand by. Let me uh, get over there first. I am standing by. Do not worry. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. No fear. Annabelle is here. And by standing by, like, doing five things at once. Ah! Mm -hmm. Here we go. Oh, I didn't hit bubble this time. Nice work. Anything on this little uh, flat bit here is happy? Yeah, anything. You know, I guess it's small that has to be relatively small, but just want to see what the what the rocks are up the top here. Sounds good. We're not still flushing, are we? Nope. Okay. I'm going to take a wild guess and say that they are rocks. Ooh. But you're idle. Mm. Iron manganese encrusted rocks. Definitely manganese encrusted. Boy trioidal, it depends. Can I downlight? Yep. Oh, never mind. I put away my mouse. Wait, get back there. Okay. How about something here? One of these little wee ones. Yeah, let's do that. Sounds good. Hey, 
it's so wee. It's, it's too okay. big, too raw. You can come up on, wait, no you can't. Kay. Yes you can, now you can. I mean, <coughs> may I? Oh. I don't know how big that one is here. Uh, which one? This one right here. Oh. This one? That one, yep. Can I get a zoom? Oh. There we go. Eh. He's maybe a little welded here. Dig it out a little bit. If maybe. not, I think this one's loose up here. Which one? Sorry, I can Right here, sorry. Oh, there it is. I kind of want to try and dig it out, though. Okay. Digging for gold. You might not be able to reach it. Shoulder all the way down. I'm almost there. I, I can reach it if I if I wrist. Hmm. Oh, oh, good work. Oh. That's the <laughs> Excalibur. Is that one's angular looking? It's That's pretty angular. angular. Yeah, I was just trying to avoid a nodule. It looks good. So much power, you know. <laughs> <laughs> With great power comes great responsibility. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, please lock the jaws, please, please. Oh, oh. oh. you don't know. <laughs> oh, you don't know. That's okay. Get it. Pick it's it up again. It's still there. It's right there. It's like right to the left of your jaw. Right there. It's diff I think it's a different one, but that's fine. That's oh. a different one. <laughs> uh, oh, there it is. I'm going to go pick it up. <laughs> you have time. Okay. That one. That one. Come on. That one. Nice work. Very yeah. nice. That only counts as one, though. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this this time it's locked for real. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Okay. Yay, thank you. Uh, which one are we putting it in? Starboard side. Yep. Which one, which one in the starboard side? Let's try to go for F. See if there's space in there. Foxtrot. Foxtrot. Can I get the uh, sample cell though? Thank you. You can tip the wrist down into it a bit. Ensure it lands there. Bonk. Yeah, nice. Cool. Boom. That's in Good. there. Thank you. Lovely. Thank you. Bonking all the cores. Bleach. No. Alright, uh, dive salvo, please. Yeah, what number was that? 162. Thank you. Please let us do the same, same, same. Thanks. Chat would like to know where we are at on our waypoint track. We Sounds are. Like a job for Nav. Yeah. <laughs> We are going to waypoint seven, which is the last waypoint, and um, we are oh about Atlanta. 30 Atlanta. meters Atlanta. away from it. So I guess once we get there, we still have a bit of time, so we just keep exploring the summit. Yeah, we're basically at the end, chat. Is the first time we, we are able to get until the last waypoint? this expedition? 
No, I think we've gotten the no, last yeah, waypoint before. Yeah, yeah. We've, we've, we've done that. Like, I can remember at least one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> at least one. Yes. It's pretty good. I think we usually get to the top, like, you know, most times. Chat also wants to know, how long does it take for those big corals to grow? How old are they? So they grow approximately one, two centimeters per year. So we need to do the math. <laughs> <laughs> How tall is Herc? Her, isn't Herc three meters? How about two meters? Two meters. Two meters. Oh, oh I've been wrong. Two meters, that's uh, 200 centimeters. Give or take. Give or take. Give or take zero. Oh. And yeah, I think it's 2.2 .2 meters tall, 1.8 meters wide, and 3.2 two meters long including the cow catcher and the light bar i think so if the coral grows at you say fish? two centimeters a year fish fish or fish. two years a centimeter there's a fish well it depends two years per decade i think oh really oh and a hollow three to the middle too let's zoom in on the fish please chat math chat math that's our conclusion. <laughs> Good oh, headshot. What is this fish? It's kind of cute. Yeah. It's very cute. All right. Thank you, Dave. I feel like the uh, cutthroat eel. I thought they have yeah, pointy zoom faces. On the, is that a whole thorny in or? Yeah, it must be. Go ahead. A whole thorny in there. Nice. What's that from the the Roomba clade? Yeah. <laughs> Umba ray. <laughs> ombre? All right. I, I don't you. think that's ombre. That's a pretty like solid <coughs> stop to that purple hat it's got. Or I guess it's more like lipstick. Lipstick? So wasn't that its like head mouth? Put lipstick yeah. on a pig? Yeah, lipstick on a <laughs> sea pig. That wasn't a pig though, it was a cucumber. What is that? So it's a wispy sponge. Can you zoom in the wispy sponge, Sweet. please? Sponge. Is it line? What am I looking yeah, at? Yeah, what is oh that? Oh my gosh. Is that trash? <gasps> on the sponge. Well, someone's been here before. I can't tell, <laughs> is it? Oh, it is, yeah. Trash. Wow. Wow. We finally found it. Marine debris. It's so entangled in the sponge. Oh wait, that's a is that a net too? That's a, it that's a, like a net. net. Yeah. Burlap sack. Yeah. Wow. Oh, Come wide, wow. please. Boo. Yeah. So is marine debris? Is that uh, Woody's sister or cousin yeah. or what? I think that's Woody's sister. Anthropogenic, anthropogenic detritus. <laughs> anthropogenic. It could be a soap opera. Or like a cowboy drama. Was it like a French French cowboy? What? Oui, oui. <laughs> Woody Debris? Oh. <laughs> Debris. Wee ha. We start to see primnoids and golden corals. Do you want to zoom it all or? Yeah, let's zoom in on the next one. The next one. Next one. There's always the next one. Here's the next one. There's the next one. Okay, Dave, go ahead. This one? Yeah. Golden. Chrysogoria. Thank you. Thanks.
chat, there was no trash on this dive until now. There was no trash before now. I think it's the first trash I've seen on the cruise. Uh, I've seen a can. Yeah, I saw a can, can, but that wasn't on our watch. I'm not very good at watching dive footage while I'm not on watch. Yeah. He's off the clock. <laughs> <laughs> a different clock. <laughs> Let's do a little uh, glamour shot before before Annabelle notices the delta. Uh, <laughs> Could be a front shot. Wee! Glamour shot. Wow, well, look at that. Oh, cotton. Nice. Oh. Cotton 4K. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Get me out of here. <laughs> Can we zoom here, please? Yes, we can. Oh, uh, it's floating. Go ahead, please. This area? Yep. So many anemones this dive. Mm -hmm. Ooh. It's beautiful. Beautiful bamboo. I feel like there's not too many polyps on that one. Wow, nice. Nice, thank you. <coughs> I'm really surprised there's not more rock outcrop on the top here. We're, We're almost right at the summit. Yet. Were you expecting like shit or? Yeah, I would expect something like that. I mean, this talus has to come from somewhere. I mean, the rocks were bigger over to the Three, right. You know? Maybe there will be a giant cinder cone on top. We can hope. <laughs> Let's do same, same, same. Thank you. Oh my gosh, we're almost there. What are we going to do when we get there? We still have... Uh, Seven months to burn before we come. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Celebrate. We tool around. I mean, we'll see what it, what it's look like off to the north. All right. What's this thing? Can we zoom here, please? Is it a sponge? Rock juggling. Just a is thin, um, thin sideways very coral. Thin coral. Wow. Militaris. Looks like a primnoid. It's, it looks like a primnoid. Yeah, I think probably we've Calyptrophora or oh. Candidella. I, I'm not sure. A, a little bit more there, Elias. Can you bump out a little bit on the map? Oh, okay. Yeah, just come out a little bit. I just want to see. All right, thanks, Dave. <coughs> yeah, we can go north after this. Okay, yeah. North. To Alaska. Roger. <laughs> We're going north. The rush is on. How far are we from waypoint seven? Um, stand by one. How far are we from Alaska? <laughs> yeah, we're about 80 meters. Can we zoom here, please? What's this thing? That's amazing. These little local star? nubbins have all, all the life on it. Local topography. Yeah, star. Yeah, Ophir Cantide. Looks like it's sitting Ophiroid. on a stool. Ophiroid. The family of oh. Cantide. Pretty coral. Oh, no. Yeah. Paula, apparently um, <coughs> on the Schmidt dive, they, a, a hydrothermal squat lobster jumped onto the. Oh, in onto Galapagos? The mm -hmm. So I described a new species from Galapagos this year of squat lobster living on hydrothermal vents. What I, did wonder, you I wonder if it's the same. Was it through, like, you saw it through a museum or something, like, yeah, a, already it collected? It was collected uh, by the E.V. Nautilus in the expedition oh. NA-63, I think, or 66. 
I don't cool. remember well. But it was collected from uh, outside of the uh, national jurisdiction, so mm -hmm. in international waters. And oh, that's, that's a pretty, pretty cool. coral too. That's a nice looking coral. Yeah, let's, let's, let's take a zoom. Sure. Uh, go ahead, Dave. Beautiful. Chat wants to know if we ever pick up the trash we find. Prim Very, very rarely. Herc's not very well suited to trash recovery. Yeah. I was on a cruise Oops, to the bonk. Endeavor segment one time where the purpose was to go out collect all the different pieces of markers and stuff that people left there hmm. and clean up the area. At Endeavor? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, there's lots of garbage in Endeavor. I think that was 2006, right about the time you were there, Dave. On the top yeah, I, was, I was there in uh, 2005. Well, actually, I think it was 2005 because I had a cruise in 2006. So yeah, okay. Bob Emily was the lead. What ship was that? Is it uh, the Thompson? Oh, the Thompson. Okay. Could be. Not anymore. Um, Paula, they said it was a Minidopsis. Ooh. That Is there a wall? Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. The wall. Maybe you could spot it on YouTube or something later. Yeah, I'm gonna get. Ooh, I'm, I'm excited. Try. What is this? <laughs> what are you? Thank you, chat. <laughs> Thanks, chat. Um, you know what it is? I know what it is. This is upside down, isn't it? No. Uh, no. Hmm. What am I, can, I seeing? Here? I can turn on some Atalanta lights and see if that does anything. Can you turn your heading like 90 degrees to port, please? You can just click, 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 click. Uh, you want me to turn my lights on? Uh, whatever you'd like. Do those choice. Let's see if it helps. Down. Yeah, okay. Well, that checks out. Okay, never mind. I don't know what I'm looking at. Go you ahead. can uh, do regular things. Roger, doing regular things. <laughs> <laughs> it's about 3,000 miles to Alaska. Oh, oh. Answering your question from before. <laughs> if we went straight north here, what would we hit? Straight north here, uh, the tip of the Aleutian chain. What if we snipped right through that? We'd hit a wall. That's that's what we'd hit. <laughs> Elias set the waypoint. <laughs> <laughs> There's an inquisitive question in chat. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, just wondering, does each region of the world have its own designated sea exploring ship? And just wondering, does New Zealand have any ship that does exploring here and in the South Pacific? So I don't think each part of the world has its own um, exploration ships. There's a, a few different ships that broadcast live dives, and I don't know if there's any others that do it, like, not live. Um, but we pick places. Um, I don't know how we pick places. Well, Rob. I mean, the, the Kiwis and Australians do have their own research vessels. Yeah. I'm not sure how they're situated. And for the most part, they try to do work that has, you know, in their waters and of their interest or those <coughs> sorts of things. In the United States, you know, we have uh, various institutions, uh, universities that kind of run uh, or operate the vessels that are owned by the National Science Foundation or the Navy. And they kind of try to work in the general area to limit, you know, transit time. 
but there are times when uh, vessels do cross into different oceans and go through the Panama Canal and work at different areas because of specialization or scheduling operations. Nautilus started in the Mediterranean. Yeah. Look at it now. It's been as far around as Samoa already. Please let the diesel meet us during 275 degrees, same speed. It's across the Atlantic, across the Pacific a couple times. Roger. Thank you. Hello. Did I? I, I noted it, but I didn't highlight it. I looked on the website, Trevor. This is my 16th expedition. So half as many as you. Like precisely half. Wild. Mm -hmm. Math never worked out like that. Right. And I'm about, I'm not precisely, but I'm approximately half of what Rennie's done. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Annabelle, did you bring the flag? Hmm? Did you bring the flag? <laughs> no. To put on the summit? Yes. Mm -hmm. The Oregon State flag. Oh, we have Canadians, too. It's possible to zoom that. <laughs> Let's go snip over here. I haven't gone the wrong way recent enough recently, so. <laughs> <laughs> Less one day beat. It's a good looking rock over here. Let's check this out. This is way the wrong way. Yeah, I mean, no, we're exploring. Good rock, going? Yeah. Oh, it's a good this, looking rock. This could be the place where the last eruption came out over. Nice. At the top. This Ocean exploration. This yeah. boulder could be the place? Yeah. If you can find a rock around here, that would be cool. I'm very far out of the box. Okay, no, no worries. <laughs> I think there'll be other nubbins like this. All right, I think so too. All right, pulling Atlanta now. I gotta go back. Driving out of the box. Come on, get there. Might pull you here. All right. So I get turn Good around. To know. Woo! Here we go. Um, Chad wants to know, is it exciting to pull up all the samples and see them in person? Very. Very exciting. We <laughs> love yeah. it. I've watched a couple times. It's super cool. Yeah, the rocks are really cool to bring up, see yeah. them in person. You know, they are super cool, Rob. And we cut them open, and that's super cool. That was Yeah, that cutting was them open cool. is really cool. My only complaint is the saw is too far Can away from where you stand, yet? and my arms aren't long uh -huh. enough. I need the cordial. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. The sound effects. Water breaks. Water breaks, yeah. Water tires screeching. And then, and then beep, beep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, zoom on the thingy, please. So there is squad in this species. Um, we haven't seen before this association in this expedition with the Oops, Idido Gorgia. Oh. Are we sampling? Uh, I'm okay. We say okay. we see another one, maybe, but okay. we have seen uh, few Thank of you. them. Come ahead. Thank you. Coming up to a lot of fan fan club over here. Oh. Not this one. This one's not part of the club. There we go. Look at the mall. The coral fan club. And we can sample rocks anytime now. I'm back in the box. Okay. So big. What well, is there a peak off to the? Uh, uh, can you tell? Ooh, I will keep going up as far as we can. Where all the uh, lava came out? <clears throat> yeah, that's what I'm kind of looking for, something like that. But this could be something 
Yeah, hey, they're all sitting on this ridge. This is nice. We can try to find the tallest rock on the mountain and take it. Yeah. Or alternatively, yeah. we can find some nearby and stack them up like a little Anuk ship. Make a, a care. <laughs> yeah. That'll really confuse them. Yeah. Got him. It looks like it gets steeper a little bit. Mm -hmm. We're pretty much at the top now. Okay, let's get a rock. Yeah. And then make a cairn. Yeah, okay. Gotta figure out Atalanta. Yeah. Oop. You can let Atalanta go crazy. We can get passed by Atalanta. That's all fine. Okay. Do you think this it might be. whole thing is the eruption spot? Because it looks like there's a like ring. A crater? Yeah, it could be. Yeah. We'd we be on the edge of the crater here. Yeah. And then it kind cool. of basins in over yeah. here. Any one of these happy? Yeah, let's get one. Okay. You can set the arm up, Annabelle. Roger. What about that one? Building suspense. That one right there. <laughs> <laughs> Just drop in and feel around. Little fish. 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 And grab that fish. Yeah. <laughs> So I'll go just stand by on the vessel move for now. Yep. We'll I think we're going to sniff around yeah. up here a little bit before we head on. Okay. Any further? Oh. Every time. Uh. Looking like something around here or over there or yeah, I mean it looks like you know something down here oh. could work if you want to get try to get one of those okay Dave can we get an Atalanta zoom please I'll try to keep it centered up like, like this one there you go just Lock like that the one. wrist that's also a beautiful shot Atlanta can. yeah and okay. Atlanta it's will still swing we might even see it go in the box this time here it is for the paparazzi shots. Mm -hmm. Aww, that small should be small rock. enough. Good. Thank you. <laughs> Let's try and put this in uh, D, please. Delta. Delta. Can we get the uh, sample salvo, please? You're gonna try and do it just off Atlantis camera? Oh, <laughs> that's a that's a challenge. That's not. Uh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> oh, I suppose I could do that other job, which is opening the box. Whoop! Not right now. There's an arm in the way. <laughs> so Delta, the Excuse farthest me. aft inboard. That's well, heavy, full of rocks. What do you think, Dave? You got more Atalanta zoom? Uh, it's one more back, isn't it? The it farthest is one back, the white backed one. one, yeah. Oh, it's a little wavy. Sorry, Dave. Okay. Uh, gonna try it. Okay. Right at the biggest ship heaves, we get the worst Atlanta view. <laughs> Perfect. Got tension spikes, we got all sorts of nice. good stuff. Nice. Nice work. Up and over. Number one, you got it? That's 163. Roger. And so make the cairn now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> As per science request, <laughs> stacked rocks for an hour. <laughs> Yeah, actually, yeah, it would be dive. neat if we could kind of trace around to see if this is a crater. So kind of keep the sediments to the right. Sounds good. Um, and for chat asking, we said those corals grow at about two centimeters per year, was it? No, I, it depends. Some of them few millimeters, some of them more. It depends on the species, but I think that the grow Rate is, is pretty low. Yeah, so they're old. So we don't just know in time how old. for a gauge check. Gauge check. Gauge check. Gauge check. 
Um, I think we're gonna stay here yeah, for now. Okay, yeah. Yeah, That's just do this. some do some sniffing. Yeah, okay. we'll just kind of you know swing around to the south here, and then uh, if it comes all the way around as a crater, that we can keep going to the north. Okay, sounds good. I think Elias nailed it and put an Atlanta right in the center. So. Ooh. Yeah. That could Why be a cool view. Yeah, you see that ledge that almost looks like it could be some flow back area into here. Why is it always a gauge check and never a check gauge? Can a gauge ever be truly checked? Oh, that's a question for you guys. Mm. Yeah, good point. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> Me too. Ooh, a little micro peak. What do we got? I'm never going to be able to reach there. Oh, it keeps going up. <gasps> uh, oh, no. Let's come back to that later. Okay. <laughs> In the meantime, we'll follow this medium, maybe, crater edge. Yeah. <coughs> Definitely is a depression. That was not 3.9. That was 2.9, and I typed it wrong last time. Nice. Good catch. What was that? What are they doing over there? Oh, Brittle star. They're very sensitive to the water movement. Yeah. We, always we are approaching, the, there are a few of them <coughs> falling from the coral. What do you think? Could it be a crater? I, it, it, you know, it could be. Looks like the tops of the sheet blows that were in the middle there. Can I give you some delta there? Sure. I got Atlanta's heading while you're doing gauges. You watch delta. Roger. It's kind of like Big Ben Parliament all over again. Look at that beautiful little <coughs> chicken nugget shape we made. Nugget. You back row in your nuggets, eh? Nugget. Holy. Mm -hmm. That really does look like a little crater at the top here. It's almost like it's almost smack like dab in the middle of our map. Yeah. It's almost like. <laughs> Well, to my untrained eye, I think the if there's a micro peak, it's going to be south of us. Yep. Shall we go there? To yes, explore? let's do that. Let's cool. do the micro peak. Let's do a, I don't know, what, what do you think, 30 meter step south? Yeah, sure. Okay. Let's go. You can go for it now. Meanwhile, I took a wrap out and none of you noticed. Yep. <laughs> Might as well check the yeah, center of the crater. There's there something beef. really cool in there. That was actually pretty cool. <coughs> big, big rocky chunky. Big chunky Luigi, rocks. No? Are you going to do a push core in here or what? Ooh. If you want to try, you can. Yeah. That's a good I'll hold idea. position. Oh, okay. Never mind. Stand by one, Luigi. Let's, let's get all, all the tools. Well, Annabelle, that's the last remaining sample and also the oh. hardest. Are you up for it? I'm scared ships, of the push core, not ship's gonna Ship's not lie. moving. Uh, if there's ever a time to try, it's I'm now. I'm gauge checking right now. <laughs> you, don't, <laughs> you don't have to. I mean, I, I'm, I want to, just not at the same time while I'm trying to gauge check, you know? <laughs> It'll take me a minute to land anyway. Look at that Roger. cucumber. Yep. Might as well land next to the cucumber. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. I want to drop a uh. push core. <laughs> get a push core next to the cucumber. Yeah, get a cucumber core next to the... Wait, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> I definitely trapped an urchin in a push core before. A shrimp ram. Look at the starboard biocam. It's got the uh, starboard rail cam, I should say. It's got oh, a little gorgeous. tabletop. I thing. know that's there's really some neat. better push cores, Beautiful. and I don't remember which ones they are. So yeah, we can talk through it. No problem. All right. 
like when we were putting them on. It was oh, you like, mean as far as suction goes? Yeah, there were like a couple that were like, oh yeah, these ones are really good. Yeah, there's no chance of me remembering that. Yeah, so, me neither. Mm -hmm. I don't remember. Good luck. <laughs> Play a little bit of push core roulette. Yeah. All right. I think the chances of this going well are 38.623 repeating. I that is very accurate. I would put it yeah. around like 15. That's irrational. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think we're good. Okay. Sure, bubbles all happy. Oh boy. Dave, if you want, we could do another Atalanta zoom. It's a little far away, but if you want. Can we go to sample size? Oh, <laughs> yeah. shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise shrimp. Do you think this will scare the cucumber? Oop. Can uh, the cucumber be scared? I don't think so. I don't think anything really I would go for the cucumbers. middle one. They, they poop and fly away. Yeah. They give Not a crap. Not because they're scared? No. That's just their way of you know, giving you the see ya. <laughs> see ya. So remember we talked about with the wrist being in oh a my gosh. flappy stage? Yep. For lack of a better way to explain it. Yep. <laughs> this. It's been a minute since you've done it, but yeah, exactly. I'll give you the most flexibility on getting that in there. One moment, please. Okay, we're doing jaws up. The, uh, the, the spiky. You can take number four, or two. That might even be easier. Three know. or four is probably fine. I don't know what what order they're in. That's great. Dealer's choice then. I think they're this all open, one. right? They're that's all two. open. Yeah, you can't it's take two at once. Let's not get no, greedy. That's, that's, <laughs> not, that's not right. This is a classic uh, Jaws half open yep. kind of situation. Yeah. You can also drop it in from the top. Another valid way to do it. Eesh. Whatever's easier for you. Whoa. Chat believes in you. Thank you, chat. <laughs> Like reaching round, like, because I can flappy like this, but getting that angle on it. There we go. I think, what if I went for the one on the end there? It's, you could do that. It's a little harder when you put it back. Oh, yeah, maybe not. <laughs> what about you? Make sure I have a good grip on it. Is that good? It's great. Yep. Exactly what you want. As long as you got grip locked. Oh, that that is a good point. <laughs> <laughs> and then I lost my flappy. Oh, your flappy's good. That's what you want. Oh, okay. Yep, perfect. Boink. Nice. Look at that. You can tell when you did it right because when... Uh, oop, am I getting pulled? Come wide on Atalanta, please. Oh yeah, totally getting pulled. I'm gonna get danger low here. Uh, you know what I'm also gonna do? I'm gonna do something different entirely. We're gonna lose Atalanta view, that's fine. Oh, okay. Atalanta's still just swinging in a bit from that last ship move, so. Okay, we're just gonna come around front like this. <coughs> now there's a spooky view in Atalanta. Yeah, it's very spooky. Especially because the altitude is under Can 10 we meters. Get the, uh, oh, that is spooky. Can we get a dive? Yeah, thank you. Okay. So you see up right there how it kind of dragged in the dirt along the way? This you is don't want to do that. <laughs> yeah, it's again fine for uh, bringing it out, but that was where you got to go from the side flappy out to the front. Yeah, Roger. like that. Looks like it's a little higher up. Okay, this is front flappy right That's here. Looks great, yeah. 
Moment of truth. See how it goes. I'm going to lock my rotate here. Eh. Yeah. Wiggle it a little bit. Wiggle's good, yeah. I'll give you more down action, too. Thank you. I'm, I'm pushing <laughs> us around a little bit there. That's fine. Yeah. Do what you got to do. Well, try and that's, take it. Yeah, that's not very much. Keep going. Put it away if you can. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> We're going yeah, I know. Oh, oh, awesome. the plop. Yeah. There's your 30%. Or Try whatever. and empty it out. Oh, the duck's back. <laughs> Bless you. Eh. Well, uh, put it back then, I guess. I don't know, unless you want to try, try one more one? science. Yeah, try it again. Try this. In. Yeah, keep wiggling. Just keep that up. It might go eventually. I do a little circular motion. You're good at shaking it out and wiggling it in. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the compliment of the day? <laughs> no. <laughs> the hard part with this is you don't want to mix up the sediment too much. Send it, you know, mixes up the push core. I think if we can get that out get that. there in one piece and bring it all the way back, then maybe it'll go. Atlanta's definitely scary, but I'm okay with it. No. Ah. Yeah, I don't know about the getting it back in one piece situation. I think at this point, give it a shot, and if it falls out, Okay, and if it doesn't, we gotta put it away anyway. Okay. Roger. Uh, yeah, it's so tough. It's not conducive to good push course. This sediment sets you up for failure. I think it's already gone. Yeah. Why did it uh, dive? Yep. So not sample dive, salvo. Sample. Thank you. <coughs> yeah, that's a great attempt Long still. Moment. Yeah. So your shoulder's all the way over already, but you can't see the arm. What does that tell you? Wrist. Wrist and? And elbow. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's it's well shook. I well shook. Roger. Aye, aye, aye. E. E. There you go. Start to see it in Atlanta now. All right. What's this thing called? Starboard bio box. Now you're in the vehicle, so go wrist left again. Oh my gosh, I'm in the vehicle. Oh. Yeah, you don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. No. Well, that was a mess. <laughs> <laughs> First push core always is. That's fine. Oh, this is a bit of a mess too. Yeah, that's oh. fine. So what? Uh, the trick for this is get it lined up as possible. Start pushing it in until it's an inch or two in, and then just release the jaws and it'll find its own way home. But you have to be at least an inch or two in, otherwise it'll flop out. Do try to push it all the way down. It's nearly impossible to align it, and you end up just getting a lot of force all bound up. Is That's that a good alignment, yeah. Okay. You can get it in the... Oh. <coughs> okay. Good start. Can I release the jaws? Yeah, it's 50-50. Ah, it's 70% chance it'll work. Now it's zero. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I, I halted it and it pulled Yeah, out. but it was the uh, had the long halt. Oh. Oh, I did the long halt. Okay. Yeah. There we go. That's 70% yes. Short halt. Nice. Oh my god. Oh now, nice. now you want to set up for side flap so you can tap it in home, otherwise we'll lose that on the recovery. Okay. Eh. 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 Is that good? <laughs> sure, that's I like great. The sound effects. Roger. So should we stop moving now? Well, I think that's fine with me. Is that fine with you, Science? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, go, um, go south. Yeah, I want to go 
works. I want to go right here. So and let's bring Atalanta way. like <laughs> this way. I don't know, 150 or something? Stand by, man. Let me zoom in into this. Sure, side. sure. So you Dive want to go? <laughs> where do you want to go? I want Herc to be like here. So I think we want Atalanta like just slightly east of south. Oh, an attempt was made. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, no, was that was a great attempt. Yeah. Thank you. Trevor, look at this, something like this. That looks great, yeah, please. Right. I'll get closer to Atalanta, then we can spin that back around. Can I please come up on Delta now? Sure. Bridge <laughs> now. I was watching your altitude, it's all good. It's making me nervous. Should, yeah. I would be the three zero meters <laughs> here in one six zero degrees, point two knots. <coughs> Oh, you are way over there. Oh, yeah. I had to spin right, Atlanta yeah, thank you. because uh, I didn't have enough tether because we were way stretched out. Oh. You can spin it back. Okay. I'll, I'll spin it back. Uh, I should be spinning it back to port, right? Yep. Port right. Port left. <laughs> I knew what port, you meant. Port correct. Port correct. On one of the, it's one of the rare occasions where chat says, that looks so hard. You're doing great. <laughs> oh. A rare occasion. <laughs> Chat, it is hard. See, Trevor makes it look easy. He's so good. Trevor does make it look <laughs> yeah. easy. Have I got a single push quarter work this cruise? I don't think no. so. So. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. This sand is hard. Yeah, it's hard for push course. It's not made for it, really. You mean it's soft. It's, it's crunchy. Cocked. It's no, coarse. It's crunchy. Cor it's yeah. too coarse. Ah, coarse. Of course. Yeah, they make our lives harder. Yeah. Even yeah. in death. Set you up for failure there. <laughs> oh, it's all right. Even in death. Even well, in that's death. what it is. They're all. Yeah, they are dead. Yeah, uh, dead phytoplankton. I thought Even you said. In depth. I thought. Yeah, I thought you said. <laughs> that would have been funnier. <laughs> Just pretend that's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Good joke, Ronke. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> My first dad joke. <laughs> I'm still admiring the crater we have on our little... Uh, mm -hmm. Little potato crater? Yeah. <laughs> potato crater? Potato crater. <laughs> With the nuggets. <laughs> Hey Rob, what about uh, this rock with the lasers? Do you want that one? That's big, isn't it? Oh, well, it's pretty big, but it's also got an associate. <laughs> <laughs> meter long coral sample, or a two or three meter long coral sample. I'll see if you can put it on top of that other rock for our cairn. Yeah, we need a really roof Do we racks. have a roof rack? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Herc needs a roof rack. We could tie it on with the coral. <laughs> Can we zoom in on the base, please? We already have a mega tuna kit in the forward bio box. Yeah, I've heard about, heard the legend of the mega mm -hmm. mega tuna kit. They had to get out it the magnum intense. for that. Yeah, it was yeah. quite something. It was legendary. <laughs> that is one tall coral. I'm excited to process that one in the lab. Uh, it had like some Polynoids, worms as well. How much ethanol are you going to need for that? All of it. All <laughs> of it. There goes the party. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Does anybody have any ideas for uh, Herc's diversary? Oh. Well, we need we that cake. We yeah, we should put a party hat on him. Yeah. Oh, cool. What is her party Herc's cat? Oh, Herc's nice. a boy, Atlanta's a girl. Oh, oh I see. Okay. <laughs> like a squat lobster. Thing. Yeah. Thank you, Dave. <laughs> Thanks for indulging. That was nice. A party yeah. hat and have it hold a plate of cake. I oh. said I we like should, yeah. at our next site, we yeah. should throw a cake down and have her find it. <laughs> no. An entire cake? <laughs> An entire cake. <laughs> no. And then bring it back up and we could eat it. Um, uh, nope. <laughs> but, yeah, would you? <laughs> Depressurized, <laughs> repressurized, wet, salty, salty cake. Gross. What if we put it in a box? Cake box. Cake okay. box. One atmosphere cake housing. 
<laughs> At that point, what's the point? You need to put it in a Ziploc bag. Titanium. <laughs> <laughs> Vacuum you pack it. Push it up. <laughs> yeah. You know, I've heard of people doing that with uh, steaks. Like cover it in marinade and... Sous vide. Well, I mean, like, put it on an ROV and bring it to depth. Does it do the same thing as a sous vide? It's less hot, so uh. no. <laughs> but it, the theory is that it squishes the flavors into the meat. And, and no. It's better? No, it's, it's dumb. <laughs> stupid, stupid idea. So I'm going to do one more tasty? Uh, sure. Oh, somebody left a candy at the data logger spot. Does that mean it's mine? <laughs> yep. Is yep. it? Is it wrapped? Yeah, yeah it's, it's pre-chewed, you don't want it, but if it's no, not it's, it's wrapped. It, then you're, it's yours, yeah. A vogel? What's that? A what? You have a to let kidna? us know. Echidna? Yeah. Echidna? Same, same, I don't same. think I'm saying it right. It's I, not the animal. I, I was going to say, isn't that an animal? No, it's a, it's a herb. I think it's a cough lozenge. Oh. A what? A cough like a lozenge. cough drop? A yes. cough drop? Yeah, it's a plant. Cone flower is another word for it. Cone flower. Herbaceous oh, e Echinacea. Uh, yes, echinacea. Echinacea, yeah. Echidna. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Echidna. <laughs> Echidna egg. Boy. Um, Chat ask when is Herc's dive anniversary? When we get to 2,000 dives, and this is 1998. Well, it's 1,000 dives, but the dive number is 2,000, right? Yeah. Yes. yeah. Yep. So, yep. What, what, how we are going to do? What? We you mean that? A party for, for her? <laughs> I, I think so. I think yes. they're brewing something up uh, mm. down downstairs. There are plans. They better be. <laughs> Do we have party hats in the inventory? <laughs> we could make one. We could make a paper cone in the data lab. That is true. If we were allowed to bring the styrofoam cups, we should have made a party hat out of a styrofoam cup. Mm -hmm. But we do have the biodegradable compostable cups that we could just draw on and use as well. That is true. If would it we disintegrate? To put a party hat on her. What? Would we put it on top of the foam or would we put it on Zeus? Mm -hmm. I think it would be on top of the suction sample. I think we might have just passed a fish <laughs> to the left. Left I'm fish. Not left entirely behind. sure. There oh, is. yeah, there it is. Yeah, <laughs> good catch. Fish, fish. What are you? Let's come back yeah, here. I'd love, love to be more fish up here, too. Cool. I am at the end of my leash. Go ahead and zoom, please. Good luck. I can try and give you a bit more delta, but we're like at 11. Minutes. Oh, yeah. Wiggling. I should just slow down. He's on his way. Sunday stroll. Yeah. It's Tuesday, buddy. Have you heard it's Herc's dive anniversary soon? <laughs> Hope you're, you're invited. <laughs> you're invited. <laughs> All right, thank you. So I'm seeing uh, approximately nothing in the way of a peak. Yeah. It's kind of just this gentle rise but uh this is this is it yeah this that, is that's it. fine i think that crater was the uh <coughs> the place mm -hmm. the last vestige of uh, eruption uh, okay what I would mean, you like to do it's more gentle to the north north we can go to the north yep yeah. oh, hi there. okay yeah let's go to the north let's do that okay uh should i be turning to starboard <laughs> You can turn to port. Port? Okay, Roger. Yes, chat to clarify that it's his one, it's Herc's 1,000th dive, but we number them in the thousands already, so like the dive number will be 2,000, but it will be its 1,000th dive anniversary. So the I see. first dive we started recording was dive 1,000. Mm -hmm. Just that way that there was no worries about leading zeros. Yeah. Can you come up on Delta, please? Roger. So if this is the peak, I thought the uh, camera down. I thought Annabelle was supposed to put a flag. <laughs> Darn. Would it be a little? Keep coming up. Roger, coming up, coming up. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yay! Nice. We have the emoji. The finish line. <laughs> Keep coming up. Keep coming wow. up. Reach the finish line. We're going. <laughs> Dave's a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> How do you do that? You keep camera camera tilting down. Roger. We got a loop in the tether, so I want to look to see if it's gone. Keep looking. Ooh. Come on. Sticky camera. 
And I'm sure if we do celebrate uh, Herc's dive anniversary, we will probably post yeah, a video. So don't worry, chat. You won't be excluded. We can go back to regular Roger. operations. Regularly scheduled programming. Back into the crater. In fact, chat, if you want to throw in a Herc dive anniversary, Can we go north now, please? Yes. Note, I will write it Let's down. Let's not wait for the movie to stop. Okay. Breathe now. Right. Coming back down on Delta. Five zero Roger. meters bearing eight degrees. Speed point two knots. Shrimp. Shrimp. Zero zero eight. Degrees, yeah. Thank you. Roger. You're welcome. No. Well, I think because the ship was going south and is now going to be going north, we might be waiting a minute uh, here. I'm sorry. These are decisions that make or break a career. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't care. I was just saying, in the meantime, let's find a thing to look at. Like maybe I'm talking this. about me. <laughs> what? What you, what you want about there? Uh, I said we should ignore him, didn't yeah. I? Yeah, he's right. I thought this was the compliment watch. Not uh, being very nice. <laughs> Shut up, Maronke. <laughs> <laughs> that, that you heard it hour. here first. And that was the word. <laughs> Shut up, Maronke. <Rocky. laughs> wow. How quickly oh. they turn. Yeah. I remember telling you old people on the Nautilus were so nice. <laughs> <laughs> the camaraderie was so high. <laughs> Look at us now. <laughs> Look what we've fallen to. Well, we got to the top of this thing, and it's all downhill from yeah. there. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm kidding. That wasn't the word. <laughs> uh. I think if that was the word, I also deserve a prize. Yeah. <laughs> you know what might be the word, though? What? Hydrothermal vent fact. That's not the word, but... Is it nice dad, dad joke? Did you say your stepdad joke? <laughs> no. <laughs> I was trying to say nice joke, and then my brain short-circuited. I said okay. nice dad joke, but it all slurred together. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Stepdad, I think the stepdad joke, though. That's an interesting one. <laughs> I've, been a, I've been a dad for a long time, and I'm also a granddad, so... Mm. Do you have granddad jokes? This, they're the same. It's just a new audience. You're not grander? Do you go by granddad? No, grandpa. Oh. My wife texted me today to remind me that it was our wedding anniversary. Oh. I'm glad she did because I had lost track of all dates. Oh. <laughs> you just told the world that, that yeah. you forgot your anniversary. Nah, she's all right with it. <laughs> It's okay. I'll be um, in Hawaii for my boyfriend's birthday. Oh, okay. So, it's a tradition, though, to not be there on his birthday. We've been married oh. for a long, long time, so she was like, I'll see you in nine days, so it's close enough. Like, yeah. Okay, so. I'm just going to be eating eggs and applesauce by himself. He only eats it when he's sick. <laughs> no, I heard it was an everyday thing. No, it's when he's sick, and uh, he clarified... Um, he said the eggs are cooked, and then you put applesauce on top after. Like uh, fried eggs? I don't know if that makes it better. No, it's scrambled. scrambled. Not getting any better. Mm. It's just not. I just need like like yellow, a little bit better. I yellow know. gooey, slimy liquids, all jammed, or mm. half, half liquids all together. So we got applesauce, we've got eggs. What else we got? Oatmeal. Oh. Oh, that's the browner Orange side juice. of yellow. But <laughs> Curry? Mm, curry, yeah. What are we naming? Curry, applesauce, egg, oatmeal is the uh, meal of choice. <laughs> well, it's kind of a brownie yellow. The breakfast of champions. <laughs> yeah. Yikes. But only when you're sick. It will cause every virus in your body to leave immediately. They're disgust. <laughs> it causes your soul to leave immediately as well. <laughs> oh, that's the side effect.
Okay, so I recently found out I have an apple tree. Uh, what's the best thing to do with 100,000 apples? Cider. Make applesauce. Applesauce yeah. and cider. Those are both good ideas. Yeah. Apple pie. Wait, you have one apple tree. Yeah. And there's 100,000 apples? Well, no, I didn't count them, <laughs> Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> okay, put that on the apple count. <laughs> <laughs> what, what kind of apples? They Size, are tartness? This big and sweet tart. Oh, really? Yep. Oh. We had three, I had three growing up, but there was nothing we could ever do with them. They were all like eaten by things before they we worms? could eat them. We got a thing fence, so it keeps oh. them out. Well, these were like small things, like a fit through a fence. Like oh, worms. really? Yeah. Oh, worms. But I don't oh, know yeah. if like the apples were mature enough to eat anyway. They were like very ugly. I think the best thing to do is to make cider, and it's actually pretty easy. Mm -hmm. You can get all the materials on. Zonam. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Zonama. Zonama. What? Oh. Echinacea. <laughs> you mean the jungle website. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's a good idea. Yeah. But applesauce is not a bad idea either. Yeah. That was the only one I thought of so far as applesauce. But you could, um, apple pie. Yeah, that's good. Can you go from applesauce to pie filling, or do you have to? Oh, well, if you, no. I don't know. Do you yeah. I mean, two different things. Pie okay. filling needs chunks. Good point. Yeah, right. Yeah. What about yeah. like how pumpkin pie is made? Could you do that with apple? Like more gelatinous, like a lemon meringue, but apple. Mm, apple meringue. Apple, like, like what's mm. the word? Like applets and cutlets, like sort of vibe. Custard. Huh. You can apple like custard. Cook your chicken with apples, like you can make a savory oh, apple yeah. chicken that's true. type yeah, that's true. My family, we have some apple trees in our yard, and we have this thing that like clamps onto the side of the table, and you like spear the apple on it, and there's a crank, and you turn it, and it peels. Oh like, yeah, I like see it, those. It's the accordion apple. Yeah, it like slices mm -hmm. it like a little accordion, and then the peel comes off in a big old ribbon, and it's so cool. So I know they do uh, apples, onions, and sausage. Fry yeah. up together. Ooh. A little bit of a little bit of brown sugar sometimes. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, it's deadly. There you go. You can put the apples in the sausage. I don't yeah. make my own sausage. I have made my own sausage, but I generally don't. It's very. It's a lot of work. You can also make apple chips for camping. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So you cut them really thin and then bake them. Yeah, bake them. You have to bake or them for a long time. Dehydrate them if you have a dehydrator. Or leave them in the sun if it's mm. summer. Right. And you don't in have Canada. bugs. <laughs> what month is it? Is it? A, it's October it's or it's August. August. It's October. <laughs> one of the seas. It's one of the months. I mean Chat said you can make a ton of applesauce in a slow cooker with cinnamon. <coughs> yeah, good yes, idea. Yes, that's very can good. Can it. We like have applesauce forever. Yeah, Please, I can. Just yeah. Good. Warm apple crisp with ice cream is the second favorite to creme brulee. Yeah. You can pickle it. Good stuff. I am so hungry now. Why did I, I bring this up? <laughs> Actually, it always goes to food, doesn't it? Pickled oh, apples would probably be really good. Sit. I've never had yeah, it before, but I've pickled no, a same, lot same. of things. Like, I pickle my watermelon rinds as mm -hmm. well. That's pretty good. Have oh. you ever had pickled really spruce tips? No, but oh. I want to make them. Ooh. They're, they're, they're tasty. tasty. Yeah. There was a Portlandia skit where they were pickling everything. <laughs> 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 I've never, I can't imagine what a pickled apple would taste like. A little bit sweet, a little bit sour. I think it would be nice. I think it would be, yeah. Crisp. I like to pickle things as well. <laughs> this may be something I try. <laughs> I'm a fan cool. of like, uh, you know those like pickled daikon? Shrimp. Oh, that's amazing. That stuff is amazing. Yeah, that's the good stuff. We're you seeing a lot of, sorry, you continue? I was going to say you could throw them at your enemies. <laughs> that's just throw them at the neighbors. <laughs> throw them for the dog sometimes. It's not my enemy, but <laughs> likes to chase them. Aww. There's a tall coral. Mm -hmm. We're seeing a lot of corals that we haven't seen in a while, like the hemicorallium we hadn't seen in the last two dives, really. And we're seeing a lot we, more prim noise. We saw, well, the previous watch had one, and we we oh, have okay. seen one today, right? Yeah. Look at this holothorian. And hey, look at these random little holes. Our last dive was holes. mainly the Random little holes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's going on here? What are the chances? Oh. Hmm. Push cores. Anybody Somebody else? was doing push cores here. That's probably this holothorian. <laughs> oh, wait. Is it this where we were doing push cores? Yeah. yeah, this is where we were doing push cores. <laughs> we're back. Um, Chad said make apple butter. Ooh. Ooh. Or apple jam. 
Yeah. Mm. So it turns out there's a lot you can do with your apples, Trevor. Yeah, good thing I have 100,000 of them. <laughs> they also <laughs> said make another apple tree. Mmm. Mm. That's slow. Long-term yeah. project. Yeah. But I still think cider is the best thing. Yeah, I love you cider. You should just make everything. Like spiced, like spiced apple cider. Both. Yeah, really and good. you can also can your cider so it lasts for, oh, just leave it in the bottles. I like canned bottle. cider. Open it with a can opener? Like <laughs> no, when I say can, I mean like jar it. I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> just like white lightning or something. Yeah. <laughs> Chat has a normal science question. Oh, uh, 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 food. <laughs> what are those long, spindly corals? The bamboozlers? Bamboozlers. The tall Single ones? Single stalk? That, yeah. Oh, it coral. has nodes. Why don't we wait to answer this question about 15 seconds? Yeah. <laughs> this is actually a really cool feature here, I think. Ooh. It's a great feature. It looks like this island, there was actually probably a, a lava lake underneath here, and everything drained back down. Shrimp. Ooh, wow. lava lake. And so lava this was the, that was probably the top of the lava lake. Here's the spindly coral. Is that the spindly coral they're talking about, though? I don't know. You'd have to ask Chat. I mean, Chat? they're all pretty spindly, if you ask me. Chat, you talking about this long one that sticks straight up? It's another bamboo. And there are a lot of colonies of Ramuligordi as well. Uh, so we can zoom here. Yes, we can. Uh, go ahead, please, Dave. What's that? Is that a squatty? Yeah. Ooh. It is indeed. Hiding in there. Whoop. Whoop. Do you want the down light on? Sure. You want to try? Sure, come wide, please. Dun dun. That was the coral chat wanted to know about. So yeah, it was a bamboo. Yeah. It yeah, it's seen a, a bamboo. Lot of those. You want to slurp this? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Kay. And they get very tall. We've are encountered many that are taller yep. than Herc. Okay. But three meters. Our tallest one was four, four to five meters, actually. This might be sampleable. Let's find out. I'm uh, turning on the craft valve. Sure. Yeah. You can Go do all the things. Can I go do all the things? What slurp jar would you like this in? Can I please get that in seven? Seven. Seven. There it is. Yep. <coughs> yeah. So for the chat, we're currently attempting to sample a squat lobster that's on a Chrysogorgia coral. Yeah. And you can tell it's Chrysogorgia because it's thin and spindly and light looking and pink and it's fan shaped on this or on bottle this shaped. It's as far right as I can tilt the camera or pan the Thank camera. Oh, it's all good. So there is a paper that came out two days ago that divide the genus Chrysogordia mm. in Parachrysogordia <coughs> and Chrysogordia. Is this good? <laughs> Taxonomist. <Sure. laughs> uh, can we zoom out a little bit? Thank you. Yeah. There we go. Can we zoom in on Squatty? Okay, I'm gonna give you some suction. Oh, Squatty's making a move. Making a run for it. Eesh. Hang on, little buddy. We won't let her take you. Let go, <laughs> let go. Let go! You can try the wrist rotate and smear them off with the edge of the nozzle, maybe? 
Oh, no. Pull. Oh. Yeah, yeah. That's, got oh. that's got him. Very good. Can you zoom out? Oh, there he is. There he is. Okay. Zeroing and... Well done. Yeah, very well done. Thank you. Whoops, that's way, way too far. There we go. So we are finding uh, for for a, a, in any of this colony. Um, so so far we have collected like 15 squad lobsters, wow. and at this at this again. moment we don't we don't have repeated species. No repeated species. No. Wow. Wow. So the diversity of these uh, animals are uh, is. High, high, high. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah. Any ones you don't recognize yet? I have recognized a couple of species, but uh, you need to study them under the microscope, study the mouth parts, the maxillipeds, and I prefer to do so in a <laughs> more stable environment. <laughs> Roger that. <laughs> uh, do you want me to turn off the craft valve? Yeah, please. Voyage now. Coming down on Delta. <coughs> Chat says a couple of things. They say good morning from Scotland. You guys are my same, favorite same, watch. Same, same, please. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, morning Chat. You. You're my favorite chat. <laughs> <laughs> the one and only. Don't say that too loud. The other one might hear. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what about side chat? Oh, side chat. <laughs> side chat. I'm going to swap out the video here for a little bit. Roger, bye, -bye. Oh, I'm sorry, SciChat. I don't see you. We love you too, SciChat. Yes. I don't see SciChat. <laughs> oh. What am I doing? Um, Chat also wants to know, what do you do with the live samples? We present them um, in ethanol or in other fixatives, and we uh, store them in the fridge or in the freezer after processing them. That means that we take pictures, we take some samples, we follow the protocols uh, that the scientists re uh, requested. For instance, for studying the morphology of the specimens, sometimes uh, it's requested to put the specimens in formalin. And for DNA studies, uh, the specimens are conserved in ethanol. We also process, um, uh, sometimes we uh, get some samples of tissues uh, for, for other purposes, such as uh, stable isotopes analysis or RNA analysis or things like that. Yeah, so there was a second question that was put in while you were explaining. Um, they do get brought to the surface <coughs> for study. And they're preserved yep. for a long time. Yep. Can we have a zoom in on this crinoid, please? Ooh. Stocked crinoid or a crinoid on a stock? Crinoid on a stock. Yeah. Ombre. It's one of those ombre ones. Frosted tips, someone said earlier. Oh, so frosted was tips is a good one, too. Yep. <laughs> 90s. Like I was uh, going to say they're stuck in the 90s. Guy Theory? <laughs> Unfortunate. The theory guy, I mean. <laughs> fiery guy. Fiery, fiery guy. Uh, yeah, fiery fiery guy. dude. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> like flavor Hamlet. <laughs> <laughs> what? Because <laughs> you know how he says Flavor Town? Uh, but I don't know if he has that trademarked. <laughs> how about. Uh, it's Flavor Town. Oh, uh, so I can say flavor with a U. No, you could say flavor too. But you can say flavor with a U, yes. Flavor yeah. with Taste a U. Taste settlement. That's the way it's supposed Taste to be spelled. <laughs> Taste village. Mouth enjoyment village. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. <laughs> yeah. The silence says everything. Uh. I'm trying to think of one. That could go with like. I'm trying to think of another one. What's this? Let's have some zoomage, please. 
Oh, look, there's tiny tracks in the sand. A primnoid? <laughs> tiny squatch? Yep. Tiny squatch? Tiny core sample. Or is it a, oh, it is a primnoid, is it? Yep. Okay. Probably Calyptrophora. Looks like. Yeah. All right, thank you. Uh, shrimp in. Yeah, that color is different. Yeah, that one was gray. That might be the, was it fully gray? Did it have any red spot on it or? It was hard to tell, I didn't, I didn't think yeah, so. I didn't, I didn't really see any red spot. You didn't? Okay. Uh, yeah. We're heading down the hill I'm now. I'm not sure. Down slope. Wonderful. Mm-hmm. In which my altitude is lower than my delta. That's what you want. Yep. What's, What's that little? little yeah. What is this? Starburst. What is this? We'll find out in moments. Is, yeah. is it a worm grab? Can we look at this worm crab, please? Worm it's not crab. crab. I said grab. Oh, worm grab. Where the worm kind of just shoots out and grabs. We've seen them before. Yeah. Wow. Or is it an aqua squash footprint? <laughs> Yet again, something we'll find out when we get that human to sand translator. Mm -hmm. We are. Yep, it's sand. Yeah, we've seen those. <laughs> All right, before. thank you. The starburst? There's sunburst? Sandburst? Sandburst? I did. Andy Sandburst? I did oh. deep, uh, deep learning applications like, you know, for the audio um, identification. Does anyone know? Identifications uh, by app of animals. Yeah, like there, there is there is I naturalist, but I don't think um, <laughs> it's more like people uploading pictures of animals they they see during their um, walks or something like that, or when people they were they go for hiking. People and do it for deep sea as well. Wild deep sea I naturalist entries. Yeah. Um, could There's a fish have made that starburst pattern? Because there wasn't like a hole in the middle of it where a worm would have gone Yeah, out. the worm should be like in a hole in the middle. Yeah. So maybe it was a fish or... Or like some sort of... I see shrimp council circle. Oh, shrimp council. And there is another app to identify urchin. rocks. Urchin, urchin. Jinx. Ooh. Did you know that? Uh, an app, a rock identification. Identification. Yeah, identifying rocks. I didn't know that. All right, let's see some ID. Um, I use the app Seek, S E E K, Ooh. and it's like a branch from iNaturalist, but I think people say it's a lot better than Seek iNaturalist. Seek is pretty good. Yeah, they have bugs, plants, birds, animals. It's good for plants. For what? Plants. plants. Oh, plants. Yeah. Plants. Chat is continuing to ask. I'm assuming the animal samples are dead when they arrive on deck because of the change of pressure and temperature. Not always. Was there any case of animal samples that are still alive and maybe moving when they get to the surface? Moving. Yeah. Short answer is yes. I'll let Paula take the rest. <laughs> <laughs> Setting follow up. Yeah. Once we get them out of that environment, <laughs> the temperature is going to drop. Like, we put them in the fridge and stuff while we're waiting to process them, but the temperature is not going to be as cold as it is down here. No, but the starboard bio box is chilled. I think the forward one's chilling feature is back on now as well. Mm -hmm. As in just sealed? sealed? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, we don't have a fridge or anything in the ROV. That'd be cool. That would be cool. Keep your samples cold with some active cooling. <laughs> what is the temperature right now? Probably around two degrees. I can there's tell no you. There's no way to know. There no is way a to way know. to know. <laughs> two degrees on the dot. <laughs> nice. <laughs> what do I win? <laughs> the satisfaction of being right. That's not enough. <laughs> That's <laughs> not fair. enough. And what do we learn from this expedition? That people are very prize motivated. <laughs> well, you're, yeah, there are a lot of competitive people on this ship. 
I just really like stickers. I don't care about winning. <laughs> <laughs> I was They're good stickers. A, I was promised a prize for cutting a rock. Really? What was the prize? A thingy. Silicosis. <laughs> <laughs> Can I cut a rock and get a prize? I don't know. It's very satisfying watching the rocks get cut because you don't know what's <laughs> inside and it's like, it's all manganese on the outside, so it could be anything in there. Yeah. It could be Aqua Squatch. It could be Aqua Squatch. Speaking of, on the Nautilus Live Instagram page, <laughs> Stephanie did a wonderful drawing of what we see oh, when yes. we cut open these rocks. Oh, really? Yeah, so you can go check out the post really that was good. put up today. Oh, it's I a beautiful to diagram. Yeah, so we did a, and I could not say this word earlier. I was like stumbling on it, lithology um, <laughs> blog on our website, nautiluslive.org. If you go under, I think, gallery, um, you'll see the blog post. Maybe even if you just scroll down from the, where the stream no. is. I'm going to check for you. But it's also on the Instagram and linked on the Instagram. Yeah, if you scroll all the way down, even on the stream, yes, underneath all our pretty little faces. Back. It's so cool. During three um, read the blog. Learn about rocks. Rocks are cool. Zero degrees. This is not sponsored by rocks. <laughs> this is sponsored by rocks. <laughs> three zero meters. Three two zero degrees. Yeah, well, yeah, thank you. There has been talk of putting dry ice in the Herc boxes. Hmm. Passing talk, not serious talk. Social deck talk. All oh, right. <laughs> yeah, I saw the I saw the blog, Steph. It was really good. Oh, thanks, Elias. Please. please. I was like, oh, you are really learning from Rob. Like, yeah. You know. We're thinking about doing another rock blog, so. The geologists are taking over. Mm-hmm. Good. They don't Squatty. get enough attention. Squatty. They don't. And I realize we highlight uh -huh. things, but we just highlight the bio and never the geo. Ah, terrible landing. Downhill. Kill me. All right. Come wide, please. Yeah, I knew it was going to be downhill, so that's why. Where did that turtle star go? Yeah. Where did he come from? <laughs> What's he doing yeah, over the, there? This is the most oh, gentle black downhill. Oh, what? Black coral. That was the word. Really? Yeah. Oh, I got it. That was one of the words, not the compliment word, obviously. But. Really good black coral. In the wild, in the natural setting. That's a naturally yeah, generated word. Yeah, that's a, word. a naturally occurring word. Yeah, it's rare. The other um, one's a compliment. The other one's a compliment. But it's said often enough, I guess. Well, I'm um, a couple times. <coughs> I think we need to go to the tape. Yeah. <laughs> the tape? Rewind. She rewind. <laughs> and it's not Shrimp. nice rock or nice grab. Nope. Mm -mm. Good job. Mm -mm. Amazing. No. It's, a, it's two words. Nice flying. <laughs> Trevor. <laughs> uh, for those of you in chat wondering about our objectives at the Johnson Atoll, we're just looking for biodiversity and geological formations, sampling various creatures um, as requested by scientists ashore and scientists on the ship, um, as well as sampling rocks. Ooh. Ooh? Long. Long, long bamboo. Chat is also requesting a drawing of an aqua squatch. And I think I have to do it now. Well, we haven't seen uh, one. We haven't seen one. Well, I can yeah. make one up. People make up creatures all the time. Have you dreamt of one? Not yet. <laughs> Has anyone dreamed of one? Anyone Can't dreaming of aqua squatch? I'm dreaming of one right now. <laughs> Are you asleep? What? <laughs> I'm thinking of Bigfoot with a mermaid tail, or Sasquatch with a mermaid tail. Yeah. I'm thinking that too, but I think it could be cooler than that. Definitely. I'm thinking about like the creature from the Black Lagoon sort of vibes, mm, but like yeah. maybe a little hairier. Yeah, but I think Aqua Squatch definitely has fins, because we've called it Big Fin before. What about like a Chanacops sort of Squatch? 
Cause the threatening face, yeah. It's got to have feet, but it's yeah. also got to have fins, right? Oh, that's the face a good of a Chinacops, yeah. Yeah. I'll make something up. Chat, if you want to follow me on my Instagram, <laughs> at Steph Weinger, S-T-E-P-H dot W-E-I-N-G-E-R, um, I might put it on my stories eventually. We got a Chana Squatch. A Chana <laughs> Squatch. That's good, yeah. That was a good one. <coughs> <laughs> Someone in the chat said, don't forget the objectives of entertaining Annabelle's parents. That's true, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this post made by my parents. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was actually William from NL. Oh. NL. Uh, yeah, New what does NL say for? They wrote it. The Netherlands? Netherlands? Yeah. Yeah, hmm. they wrote it before, but now they're. I think their name is pronounced Willem. Yeah, Willem. I'm is. sorry, Willem. Yeah. Or maybe Willem. I guess that's South African, never mind. I just read the first couple letters and the last couple letters and made it up in the middle. Um. <laughs> that's another, either a primnoid or a Bouy thin no. bamboo. Right ahead of us? Uh, to the left. To the left. This big bushy one? Yep. Please test the uh, What's that dark meters. spot in the side? Zero, 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 zero. Zero. Have a zoom on this coral? possibly from Noah. And speed. where's the dark spot? Uh, it was another coral. Oh, okay. This one? That's what you're looking for? Right, yeah. It's a prim Noah. No. Oh, right. it's a bamboo? It's a bamboo. Yeah. Look there. Oh, I see the nodes, yeah. Oh, you're right. And you can but stay zoomed in a sec, and I'm going to go over it, here. There's the calyptophora. Mm -hmm. Two and one. Squatty. Squatty. Yeah. And a squat, my goodness. And uh, eat it the core diamond. All right. Thank you. Come wide. Wow. <laughs> Chat says it's 3 a.m. here in Chicago, but I love this. It's so mesmerizing, and I live for the scientist banter. Does that mean we need to keep bantering, or this Chicago person will not live? Let's <laughs> turn I think it if we up. stop bantering, <laughs> maybe they will go to bed. Talking. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. Maybe when we stop the dive, they'll go to bed. Well, we're coming off bottom in about 12 minutes, so at that point... You mind if I we'll take a look silent. at the tether here? Sure. There it is. Says, compliment right there. words, are they rock wow. star? It's not rock star. I don't think we're going to hear the compliment words <coughs> with 12 minutes left. Nice slurp. Nope. Good shot. Close. <laughs> nice shot. Nope. Great shot. Nope. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> nope. Nice zoom. <laughs> nope. Cool stuff. Nope. Uh, nice typing. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, oh, thank you. You shouldn't have. <laughs> Amazing data logging. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you guys are too much. <laughs> data logger underappreciated. <laughs> what a difference from shut up, we're okay. <laughs> are we doing good pilot, bad pilot? Like, what's going on here? <laughs> Surprised the amount of sediment up here. Is that a what's this thing? Yeah, the long thing. Is that spongy a spongy debris? debris? Dead eel? Uh oh. let me see. How am I gonna get over there? I can't just plow forward, there's corals in front of me. You can zoom up and over. Would a dead eel sink? Mm. Or float? If a eel dies and there's no one around to see it, to truly sink. I don't know. Uh, zoom in, please. I think it's spongy debris. I think it would sink. Unless there's an abnormal amount of air in its swim bladder. Do they have reason. a swim bladder? I don't know. They're a fish. But like salmons don't have swim bladders, do they? Have salmonids? Yeah, all right. Thanks. Come wide. 